Good morning guys. Well, it's morning at the time of this filming. So this is going to be a collab with Dume Bilia. I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. Dume Bilia. Dume. Dume. Dume Bilia. <laughs> this is the look that I chose to go off. So this is the look I chose to be inspired from. Now I actually wasn't doing this full look and everything with like the glitter cut crease and everything. Oh, I'm sorry guys. But I wasn't doing it with the glitter cut crease. But I was like, oh, I have no glitter. And then halfway through, I was like, I'm kind of feeling this. Um, I think I want to add more glow. But I'm going to do it off camera, like probably with an eyeshadow or something. I used my Juvia's Place palette for this look. And it feels refreshing to just be doing a look with it and not bring you like hair. Because I know it gets a little bit overwhelming for you guys. It's overwhelming for me as well. You know but it really it really feels good to be collabing so i hope um people who have reached out you know i can collab with them because yeah i've been reaching out and i actually asked her to collab with me um she dm'd me and she was like oh my gosh something about, i think it was jaleel something like good cute boy or something like that. i don't know but i was thinking it was related to jaleel and i was like bruh collab or no and she was like oh my gosh yes and i was like ah because I already did a look from hers years ago um, when I had like some like pigtail or ponytail. Me eat the ketchup in a two with my blonde hair. And it was one of her looks. She's just absolutely gorgeous. I'm looking at her Instagram. She's absolutely gorgeous, beautiful, and so, so freaking talented. She's, she's amazing. She is absolutely amazing. Oh, here's another. She is just ah uh, oh my god, Dume! It's an honor. It is a complete honor, a complete, complete honor to be working with you. But anyways, it's for this entry, guys. Um, let me know what you think of this look. I am in love, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. <laughs> Peep my nails though. Ah, uh, peep my nails though. Ah, uh, Cassie nailed it on. Oh, it was so brown. But, but she did the damn thing, honey. I need to own my cuticles because I'm looking to it. Enjoy the video. All right. So this is my LA Pro Primer in Nude. Um, this is what I'll be using so the colors can pop. Also, you guys, I did not say this in the intro. I don't know how I forgot to say this in the intro. But you guys have to go over and subscribe to Dume Bilia. Dume Bilia. Yes, Dume Bilia. You have to go over and subscribe to her. We were talking back and forth yesterday on Instagram. I was like, oh my gosh, I really hope, like, you know, I did her look justice. Like, I represented it to the fullest. Even though in midway it turned out to be something like I was inspired from. I'm just completely gobsmacked by her raw talent. And not only is she talented, but she's not a female dog. You know, like, she's actually a nice person and amazing to talk to so what i'm doing i'm creating the cut crease like the more instagram cut crease and i use the same brush i used to do my brows um to do the cut crease so now i'm just kind of blending this out a little bit or rather removing some of the product with my finger i could use a brush but i just use my finger because of the warmth because if i don't do that then it's going to crease so i'm going to go in with the festival palette and i'm going to be taking uli 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 and, and that's the white and I'm going to be putting that right at the beginning then to blend the other colors I'm going to be putting them beside each other and kind of feathering over in order to get the other colors to blend so that's my little, um, my little trick in blending so now I'm going in with Irijai Irijai? I-R-I-J-I -I, I think it's Irijai and notice the brush I'm using it's a small tapered brush and I'm using that brush because I want the colors to come off vibrant one it's smaller so I can be way more precise too and it was the only brush to have that was clean so yeah okay um so next I'm going in with Izafa I Z A F A Izafa I believe it's called and that's going right beside the pink you guys check out Dumi's look that she did ah oh, that African look is like so bomb I love the dots she did it's so nice and clean anyway, so I'm going in with my Afrique palette again from Juvia's place and they didn't have any blue in that palette I was using so I went to my Afrique and I used Cote d'Ivoire Cote d'Ivoire 
coat the no 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 I use the only blue the blue from the palette because her look had a purple and for the palette that I have from Juvia's over here because I'm by my grandmother's house and I'm um, doing this and I don't have any purple so I just chose to use the blue because you know red and blue make purple so there's like a hint of purple but but not a lot when I'm blending it's like a little tops of purple but no more leap and then you can see the blue but yeah so now this is where I was like wow well, I'm probably not going oh this is my cover girl full spectrum um eyeliner and it's in black black is to black um right so at this point i was like okay my, my look would probably not look exactly like hers so let me just go off of a heavy heavy inspiration so here i'm just going in with that color and i'm just going to darken the um to darken the crease darken the cut crease basically and that's what i use it to do to darken the cut crease so i'm going to get a dome brush and i'm going to blend that out that's the same brush i've been using I'm going to clean it off a little bit and then come back with it again and to just blend out um and I'm going to add more ah see I'm going to add more and just blend out to have a nice little smoky look wow it's just so nice to be back doing you know tutorials I really missed it I didn't think you guys wanted to see them so I wasn't posting them but I really really miss it doing, doing tutorials and I miss doing collabs you know um yeah and it's just an honor to start out this collab with Dumi. she oh gosh i'm not y'all gonna think i'm gay i'm not gonna go no further she's just she bad so it's just an honor to be working with her um again with my festival palette and this is iri jai again and i'm putting you guys know i love to put colors right at the beginning of my brow bone so that's right that's what i'm doing i'm using the pink i'm putting it right at the beginning of my brow bone but i'm going to go in with oro and oro is going to go on um the tail of my brow bone yeah so i forgot to say um those of you who are here from Dumas channel hi i'm so sorry to say it in the intro or anything my bad you guys when I filmed this, I had a doctor's appointment. Oh, and yes, I went to the doctor looking just like this, mama. I did not wipe off anything. So thank you so much, you guys. For those of you who are watching, if you have not yet subscribed, please go ahead. Look at that. I love those colors. I just feel like it works well. I love that color for my brow bone, too. I love orange on my skin, too, and I feel like it looks really, really good. But yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you have not and click that notification bell. So this is my um, LA Pro Primer in black. I have it in black, nude and white. The nude, is, the nude is what I used earlier to make the colors pop as a base. And then I'm using the black and I'm blending it out again with a tapered brush. I'm literally using this one brush for everything, baby. Except my brow bone area while I'm going to use. Back into the blue, the only blue in the, um, what's it called? The Afrique Palette? it's called the yeah a free palette and i'm just blending that and then putting that right where the other blue ends just to just just to, sorry for some cohesion and just to brighten that blue because it's kind of paling out because i was at that era working and blending so some of the colors gone kind of left um so yeah so this is the same brush that i used to apply the base my um la pro primer nude so this is the same brush i use so i'm taking whatever's on the brush and just putting it right there and then i'm going to go over that with the pink from the palette and this is iri jai no it's the red i use the pink yeah, iri jai and again this is the festival palette and i'm using iri jai just to add a little bit of a difference i should have gone with the orange i was thinking do i want to use the orange or pink I'm like hmm, let's do the pink Therefore, we should have gone with the orange. The orange would have given it a bit more pop. So now I'm going in with Izafa. Izafa. I do not know how to pronounce these names. So I'm going with Izafa. And I didn't see this on camera, but off camera, I went in with a clean, clean brush and just blended out. I'm right there where I'm applying Izafa. I just blended it out so it doesn't look as choppy or sharp. So now I'm going with my lipsies and I'm taking Prime Prince here from CoverGirl and it is a matte lippy. It's a full spectrum and it's their matte. It's, it's a matte lippy. They call it the matte idol. So oh, and my nails are from Cassie Nailed It on Instagram. The lashes I'm wearing are from my lash line, Power Me Bar Lyric. You can go right now on Poem Bar Lyric on Instagram. I have several businesses. I have lashes, brushes, and fitness belts. Fitness belts is stuff that you work out with. 
for the glow i'm using my fenty beauty cinnamon and this is it for this tutorial thank you so much for watching thank you do make oh for collabing with me you have no idea how much this means to me i'm completely grateful and my bonnet by the way is from a second enofe she's also on instagram thank you guys for the love and the support please don't forget to subscribe and please i beg of you go over to dume's channel and check her out she is bomb Mwah. talk to you later dume thank you so much for collabing with me love <laughs>